if somebody was inside of hut or let's say right here outside of squeaky and the, in this position you know the bombs inside ramp you have two cts this exact spot okay this happens enough times that I will say that there is a kind of an appropriate reaction here. And that's that if the T's who are grouped up in this position and you know they're waiting to go and get back the bomb because they absolutely have to, it is their objective. They're not gonna win the wrong by elimination. They're gonna grab this bomb with a minute left at some point and they're probably going to try to do it together. Now, if you wait, then you leave a seed of doubt that there could be someone who is taking a long path outside then the cts that are out here will adjust accordingly or when they're sitting here outside ramp and stuff like that they'll come back and check and you'll open up more timing so that when you do take ramp the cts might not be there it just gives you an extra chance that you will have less bodies watching the bomb despite what happens in the rest of the round at that 30 second mark is when teams will make decisions about what site to go to they'll start working into a site they'll start throwing their initial grenades it won't be in a default anymore unless it's a mid-round situation very late 30 seconds is really the golden number for me so with that in mind you've got kerrigan in a position to flank they can wait till like the 40 second mark trail slowly behind whoever's coming out or the three players who have already gotten the bomb let's say they got it early come back to upstairs and you have a good angle to fight them in it might be very clear actually that a lobby push would come and it's important that mouse since they have nothing else to do because they're trying to open up timings by waiting can sit here and watch this hut push but are not anticipating it just yet so we're crossing the 45 second mark now the bomb will get collected there's still the threat of heaven there's still the threat of this and there it is at the 40 second mark kerrigan comes through on the flank and tries to find that exact timing now it looks Maybe a little silly from Kerrigan's perspective, but you can see how close he was to actually getting them as they were jumping down into the site. So that nearly worked out perfectly, but it was good awareness from Torzu the whole time. 